Hey guys, I'm here to show you the new Lumineer Lux flight controller. It has a pretty unique hardware layout. Um, you'll see that your sign ESC signal out corresponds to each physical arm on the frame. You've got one, two, three, four. So this enables you to easily wire the speed controllers to many popular FPV racing quadcopters. The board accepts 6 to 26 volts on the bat pad. For those familiar with the NAS32, it uses two separate pads for voltage sense and then actually powering the board. We've merged that into one pad and we've named it BAT. On the front of the board, you'll notice a dedicated boot button that allows you to put the board into a bootloader mode where you can always restore the firmware um, to factory defaults if you ever have any errors. You can see we've put vias all around the pad so they don't lift up when you solder it. You can apply quite a bit of heat and the, and the pads will not move away off the circuit board and break the traces. We've hand-picked each component on this board to ensure that it's the highest quality we can manufacture, including all SMD components and the bare circuit board. We're proud to be working with Boris B on his Betaflight firmware, which is a fork of CleanFlight and you'll see all of the features being used on this board and his firmware. The Lux supports a bunch of accessories such as telemetry, uh, reporting to your OSD, a buzzer, black box, PID stick tuning from OSD, um, LED strips, there's an LED pad, and a current sensor, and GPS can hook to any of the three fully available UARTs that's not interfered by with the USB. It's an amazing little board with almost too many features to mention in one video.